Today is another exciting day because excavator crew is coming back. Next up is to level our site flat where the utility building and the RV pad will go and where the house site will go too but that has a big pile on the house site so I won't be able to put it all flat. That's okay and I'm gonna deal with the house until next year. Another thing is that we have the septic tank scheduled to come to be delivered tomorrow so they'll also need to excavate the hole for the septic tank. So we'll see how far we get today. It is forecasted to have quite heavy rain starting 10 o'clock uh, so we'll see how much we can get done with that. Since they were here last time we have cleaned up all the mess they made in terms of the trees and the stumps. So the stump and the slash is gone from this area and we also marked out kind of the boundaries of where the septic tanks might be in and there are a few more trees that need to come down because they will be in the way of the septic tanks. So the first thing that I'm going to do is uh, set up a laser so that we can measure the depth of where they're excavating. So the contractor is here and he is working on grading and today I'm running the grade stick. So he's using the excavator to flatten that area just by rolling back and forth over it and using the weight of the excavator to flatten it. That way when we drive over it with our truck, we won't sink into all that mud. We've been trying to divide and conquer on the work here today. So while Diane has been up here running with the grade stick and finding level, I've been down at the shipping container preparing the septic laterals. So these are some of the pipes that will be in our septic system and they need a little 45 at the end and a cap. So I've been cutting all those, getting those all glued up and ready to go. So they're down there now, they're curing. That way when we get to the septic, maybe tomorrow, they'll be ready to go. And we're not doing loads of prep in the field where it's kind of dirty and it's hard to do and it'll be in the heat of the moment. Instead, I did it down by a shipping container when I could do it in a little bit more, more of a controlled environment, I guess you'd say. It is probably, you can probably tell, it's starting to rain now. So fingers crossed, this doesn't hold us up too much. It does look like it's gonna rain all afternoon now and it will get heavier this afternoon as well. We're just hoping that it doesn't slow down the excavator and they can continue to, to work. The good thing is, I guess we'll kind of see if our grading is working. We'll see if the drainage starts to, uh, to do what it should.
So excavator has started leveling this side and it's pretty much at the grade where we want it to be. So he brought the fill from where he excavated it. And here, believe it or not, this area is grabbed out. That's actually at pretty much at the same height. But with the eye looking at it, it just seems lower. So I had to do a sanity check. So even from this side, this is the newly leveled bit and this is where it was dug. Even from this side, to the eye, it looks like that is lower, but here's what I did. I put the level straight and line it with where the excavator is, where it's sitting on the flat ground. That actually is level. And check in the background how steep that wall is. You can see kind of yellow line running across the top of the wall. That's the tape. This is really level and the eye wants to think that this is level. We've had a really good day today here with the excavator on site. We started this morning and this place was just a complete mess. There were giant piles of rocks everywhere and it was honestly really hard to work out what was going on. In just one day, even with some pretty torrential rain, uh, we've managed to get the whole site pretty much flat up here. Now it's not perfect. There are still some areas we need to, to tackle. There's still a fairly big uh, rocky outcrop here. We were peeling off some really, really nice pieces of rock. And, uh, and yeah, that was pretty cool to see them coming out. The plan now is tomorrow morning, we're gonna come back out, we're gonna shoot grade again, get things, uh, get all the grade sticks back in, see where we're at, and then we can do any fine tuning that we need to. And then the plan is to get the septic tanks installed tomorrow. So they're scheduled to arrive at midday. Right now, there are some trees in the way that still haven't been cleared, we haven't got to those yet. So the excavator is gonna take those down, remove the topsoil, remove the stumps, and dig some nice deep holes for the septic tank and the pump tank to go in. So uh, yeah, that's the plan for tomorrow. Mm -hmm. 